equations are written in math mode you can enter math mode with an opening and closing dollar sign if you want inline equations and you are writing the equations with within your text you can add single dollar sign say for example we are writing inline equation that is within dollar sign a plus b equals to c and dollar sign closing dollar sign this is our first method so you can compile it and get in line math mode equation you can see here now the second method is displayed equation on its own and uh, equations uh, in the separate line then you can add double dollar sign so if you want displayed equations then you can add double dollar sign and you can write the same equation as a plus b equals to c and here double dollar sign again then you can see the effect let's see now this is on separate line you can write this equation as showing your equation number on your document by typing the command of slash begin equation and slash end equation that is slash begin within curly brackets equation and slash end equation now you can write the same equation so you can see the difference now compile it and get its result this is the equation number one now so these are the three types of preview of equations this is uh, due to single dollar sign within within line and uh, this is the double solar double dollar sign equation and this is the slash begin and slash and command equation now how to write the fractions in your equations that is double dollar sign and you can have slash frac and two set of curly brackets one is for nominator and the other is for denominator you can add a and over which will go in over and close it by double dollar sign so a over 3 this is our equation and uh, fraction can be nested as say for example uh, you have two fractions one is frac and uh, in the this is the nominator and in nominator suppose you have y and the, in the denominator you you have to uh, type the fraction again then you can add this command again slash frac and again set of curly brackets now you can add say for example here is 3 and uh, x and 
plus b and enclose it by double dollar sign so you can see here y over 3 over x plus b and the next is roots how we can type the roots in our equations that is slash s q r t and within curly brackets you can add y hat to double dollar sign this will produce under root y square this okay and uh, again if you want to type the square root a in another form like this slash sqrt and within square brackets you can add some text and within curly brackets again y hat to and enclose it by double dollar sign now let's see its effect here here you see x and this is y square and the next one is uh, sums and integral that is also super easy that is slash int and uh, you can add suppose you want to type a in the lower limit a in and uh, hat b f of x now let's compile it you can see the integral equation this one is the integral so in this way you can add your own lower and upper limits and as well as you can make the sum that is slash sum underscore sum underscore within curly brackets x equals to 1 and uh, raised to power 5 and y raised to power z so now compile it this one is the sum you can add greek letters by adding slash slash sign in your equation and uh, I also introduced you about the Greek letters, how to add Greek letters in our document. In my previous one video, I told you about that. So, this is slash dollar sign and if you want to type alpha, slash alpha. This one is the alpha. and you can add another greek word like theta that is so theta so you can make your own equations by using these simple commands and you can uh, you can change these equations by uh, your choice so it's 
it will not be difficult for making equations in latex now so thank you